Hello and welcome to another Gubbins video and today we're going to learn how to make an Apache web server. So make a new window for your terminal and first we're going to update all our repositories so we can get the Apache Apache's latest, latest version. Okay, And once that's done, go ahead and install Apache 2. So to do that, I'm experiencing a bit of lagging here. OK. There we go. OK. So now that our, our repositories are updated, let's just go and install Apache 2 which I already did, and there we go. So now that Apache 2 is installed, you can go to your local host. This is the website I made, but you'll have a website, a starter website with where your website is, where the index.html file is, etc. And this is the website I made promoting Kung Fu Panda 4. I love that movie. So, yeah, there we go. And then uh, if we go to, to Terminal and we go to var www HTML, which is the default place for the index file, then you will have index.html, no style.css, okay? And what I did is I made a simple HTML website. See, welcome to the Gubbins YouTube channel. That's the, the title that you see here. I linked to my style.css page in the title or in the head bar. And then I put a header, check this image out, put a source which is the image's source. And I put also an alt code at the end, which alt or the, the alt, alt message. Alt messages are for people that are blind or, or when the image doesn't load up properly so that you can actually see what it says. This source is really long. Well, the alt I did put was Kung Fu Panda 4 uh, with a question mark. Man, does this ever end? Oh. Zoom. 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 Anyways, so I put uh, Kung Fu Panda 4 with a question mark. I changed the, uh, I put a background color in my style.css, which I'll show to you right now. And the cool thing about Apache Web Server is that you can not only test this website on your 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 machine or computer, whatever you want to call it, but you can also try it on another computer. Okay, and to do that, you're gonna to need to use your your IP address. You gotta find it with ifconfig. Okay, and I'll show it to you in a bit, but or actually, I, I won't show my IP address. Hopefully, I don't get. Um, hacked but I'll still show you what it looks like okay let's continue continue what the hell okay 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 anyways there's the same thing as like there's gonna be like an alt over here and then it's gonna say come panda 4 with a question mark and if we go inspect here and I go to the image See, alt equals Kung Fu Panda 4. Okay. So to get your IP address, I have config. Just type that in your terminal. Okay. And I'll show you how it looks. See, you, you put I have config. And then you're going to want not 127.0.0.1, which that's it. That points to your IP address. Okay. And it's like localhost, which I've typed in here. 
But for other computers trying to see your website, you're going to need to put this IP address, the one starting with like 192.168, the one that is unique to your computer, okay? And just like that, you can have your website shown anywhere. And I would say that Apache Web Server is a great way to start making websites and test them out. For sure, you can try a Wix website or GitHub Pages is really good as well. But I would say that Apache Web Server is your simplest route to testing a website. So now I'll show you how to stop the web server. So let's just go. Oh, OK. So let's exit. And yeah, OK. Let's show you as well the, the style of CSS real quick. And there you go. Body, background color, which is this light green that we have here. And to to stop the the Apache web server, just write what what was it again? Let's see. It's C D Oh no. Okay, sudo sudo etc in it dot d slash apache2 oh, my bad apache2 and stop you can also go with start or restart okay but i'll go stop stopping apache2 and now if you go ahead this site can be reached. Let's go ahead and put it back on. Start. Now, voila. Okay. So that's Apache uh, web server. I hope you enjoyed. And um, yeah, keep learning. Make yourself a cool website, and that's about it. Thank you, and see you next time.